So it's been known for quite a while that Ilhan Omar apparently married her own brother to help him gain entry illegally into the country. That's a violation of immigration law. That actually happened, it turns out. And now we're learning the FBI had evidence to confirm it, but didn't do anything about it. Miranda Devine is an actual journalist. She works at the New York Post, where she writes a column. She joins us tonight to explain what exactly happened. Miranda, thanks so much for coming on. Pleasure, Tucker. Well, uh, some uh, basically Republican operatives um, up in Minnesota decided to spend uh, hundreds of thousands of dollars on private investigators to really find out if Ilhan Omar was a genetic match, uh, the DNA match, to uh, the man who was her second husband. Um, they went to three continents. Uh, they found a cigarette butt and uh, a drinking straw, which uh, they decided they sent it to an, a DNA laboratory and found conclusively uh, that the DNA matched, that the second husband was a sibling, uh, according to this DNA sample. So um, the, the very day that they were going to unleash this on the world, and in fact I was interviewing one of the people involved, um, the FBI swooped on uh, the, the gentleman, Anton Lazaro, from this, uh, this Republican uh, pack up in Minnesota um, and arrested him on some different charges. Uh, who knows whether, you know, he's guilty or not guilty. I mean, he's not guilty until uh, proven, but he's in jail. And so his story never got oh. to see the light of day. I mean, luckily, he'd, he'd uh, told the FBI they were not interested. They told him the statute of limitations had run out. We managed to see the website before he took it down, before he was arrested, and managed to report the story such as it was. I wonder, I just kind of spitballing here, what will be more shocking to her fellow liberals? The fact that the fact that Ilhan Omar had an incestuous marriage to her own brother or that she smokes cigarettes. Which will they be more stunned by? <laughs> Definitely the latter. And they've got photographs yeah. of her smoking the cigarette, so I don't think that's, uh, that's at all in doubt. Yeah, incest is just a kind of alternate lifestyle, but smoking a cigarette, <laughs> <laughs> that's immoral. Uh, so just to be totally clear, she did marry her brother, we know that. Not only repulsive, but illegal, it's fraud. She's not been indicted, she's not gonna be indicted. That's totally cool now. Well, the FBI was told uh, by one of uh, these associates of these people that found the information uh, and was just told no, that the, uh, they've just decided the statute of limitations has run out on marriage fraud, even though there's no statute of limitations on immigration fraud. Yeah, or on smoking cigarettes, apparently. Randy Devine, great to see you tonight. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thanks, Tucker. Hey, Sean Hannity here.